BMI kind of question. Let's look at this question. It says that this uh, study the percentile chart in NXR C and answer the following questions. Uh, before we study the NXR C, I want us to read the statement. Coach Maxwell, the trainer at a local athletics club, uses percentile chart to determine the health status of athletics who are joining the club in order to determine the best exercise for them. Coach Maxwell allows athletics whose BMI are between 5th and 95th percentile to join the club. Okay? This is the percentile that we have. That they are saying that you only allow those who are between 5 and 85 percentile to join the club because according to him, he look healthier. They look healthier, I mean. So if you look at this BMI chart, we have years or age in years here. It represents the age in years. We have the BMI in kilometers, kilogram per meter squared, I mean, in kilogram per meter squared. If you look at these two lines, they represent the same thing. It's, B, it's the BMI here, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, up to 34. We also have the percentile from the third percentile up to the 97th percentile. Not to forget that the coach Maxwell, you only accommodate people of 85 and the fifth percentile. We can just draw. This is 85 here. And go and check. This is 85. You only want people of 85 percentile and the fifth percentile. If you fall under this, you qualify to be in his team. That's what the statement says. That's what the statement says. Only people within this line are able to be in his team. In terms of BMI here, we can say that is 19. The BMI of this point is 19. The BMI of this one is 27. So the highest BMI is 27 for you to be to qualify. The lowest BMI is 19 for you to qualify. You must not forget that. And these are in kg per meter squared. Let's look at the first question. Let's look at the first question. The first question says that what does the abbreviation BMI represent? What does BMI represent? We know that it represents body, mass, index. Then 5.1.2, it says that determine the maximum BMI that a boy should have to be able to join the club. We already discuss about this we said the maximum is going to be this the minimum is this one so for to answer this one is very simple we just have to say 27 kg per meter squared 5.1.3 the next question says that hence when they say hence it means that we should use the previous answer don't forget the previous answer is the bmi so Determine the maximum weight of a boy who is 1.8 meters tall and whose BMI is considered healthy for a boy athletic. You may use, they say we may use BMI is equal to weight divided by height squared, which is the same as weight divided by height multiplied by height. So the BMI, we already have the BMI of this person. We said it's 27 kg meter squared, which equals to weight. We are looking for weight. Then height is 1,8 multiplied by 1,8. I prefer to use 1,8 multiplied by 1,8 because sometimes when we have 
when we use 1,8 to the power 2, most of you, you get confused there. So when we multiply, it's easier. So the next thing that we're going to do here, we're just going to multiply the two. Uh, I forgot to put the units there. Everything is in meters then. So we're going to have 27 kg per meter squared is equal to weight over 1,8 multiplied by 1,8. 1,8 multiplied by 1,8 is equal to 3,24 meter squared. It become meter squared because we have this meter and that meter. Then the next step, we can just cancel this meter squared and this meter squared. We can remain with only what? Only kg. Then because we are having the uh, fraction, we can also make this one a fraction on the other side so that we can know what to do when we do the cross multiplication. When you do the cross multiplication, you're going to say 1 multiplied by weight is equal to weight. Anything multiplied by 1 remains that thing. We also multiply these two to say that 27 kg multiplied by 3,24. 27 kg multiplied by 3,24. Then our answer here, the weight is going to be 27 multiplied by 3,24. We find that the maximum weight is 87 comma 48 uh, kg we answered that question moving to the next one 51.4 it says that a 14 years old boy whose weight is 48 kg whose height is 1,3 meters claim that he qualified to be admitted to the club calculate the bmi of the boy so we're calculating the bmi we know that we're gonna say b m i is equal to weight divided by height multiplied by height and then the weight of this boy is given as 48 48 over height multiplied by height which is 1,3 multiplied by 1,3 let's do the calculation let's calculate here uh, we have 48 48 over 1,3 multiplied by 1,3 our answer here is 28 28,40 28, kg per meter squared. Let's go and check if he is telling the truth. Is he telling the truth? Let's check. The minimum requirement we said is 19. The maximum we said is 27. He is not qualified. He is not qualified. He's above 27. He is not qualified. You're going to conclude to say that he is not qualified or the claim is invalid. Invalid. He's above the maximum BMI requirement. Thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like or to comment or to ask questions. I'll see you in the next video.